I'm homesick, and uh, it's a weekend, and I'm homesick, and that sucked. Why couldn't I have gotten sick at work? And I just realized that on Netflix Instant, they renewed all their 007 movies that everybody freaked out about them dropping. That's what Netflix does. They drop a lot of titles, then news outlets like Yahoo and other news sources freak out and say that Netflix is dropping everything, but they're not dropping it. They're rotating. They've got like a big menu of stuff, and they rotate it. And eventually, 007 comes back, and all the 007 movies. And when stuff gets renewed, they also bring on new things. And it's really odd that they brought Digimon. It's such an obscure anime from the 90s. It's kind of like those card fighting Pokemon games, but it's a, it's a little different. I don't know how it's different, but I know that I like it a lot more. I'm getting nostalgic feelings as I watch it. Um, I had an idea, though. Everybody like me who loves retro, why don't you get on the actual DVD plan of whatever video service you choose. I choose Netflix. Get on that DVD plan and rent the physical DVD so that companies actually realize, whoa, or they see the numbers of retro content being rented out. And if they see more retro content that's not streaming being rented out on the physical DVDs, maybe they'll say, maybe we should up our retro shows on our streaming services. I don't know what Blockbuster is like, the instant, what do they have with Ditch Network, but maybe if Netflix saw Blue Thunder, the TV series, which I just rented, or Digimon, I was renting them, but now that it's on Netflix, instant. Sorry, I'm being distracted by the noises. Um, or if you rent Mork and Mindy or The Greatest American Hero and they see all those DVDs going out of their company, they'll start thinking, maybe we should do a lot more retro stuff than we already have. Netflix already has a ton of Netflix. I mean, a ton of retro stuff. We've got Cheers. They used to have Cosby. Um, they've got A-Team, MacGyver. But uh, maybe if we start renting movies like the Flash, or TV shows like The Flash, uh, Smallville, the other su Lois and Clark, other retro shows like that, and even uh, earlier retro shows in the 80s, like, uh, I don't even know if Manimal is on DVD yet, but just shows, if you have a favorite show, start renting the physical DVD and pass this idea around, don't pass this video around, I'm not looking for numbers because I can't get past 30, but pass that idea around to other retro people on your page or whatever, and maybe, I don't know, maybe it'll work, oh, I'm sick, I feel like crap, I'm going to stop this now, see?